Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Randy. Um, I'm trying to keep an eye on the um, <laughs> sounds just to make sure. Hopefully the mic sounds a little bit better. But we are back playing more Luigi's Mansion in the last one. We took care of the security boss. Dealt with an elevator baddie. I don't know. And now we're, I don't remember what floor we're at. Bad thing is I played two days ago. I try to do these in batches. Okay, we're going to two. I guess you have to have those magnetically going, otherwise we could just go to the top floor. Like, just saying. Luigi, the elevator can take you directly to lobby floor two. You might as well head that way and check, out, check it out, I say. Fuck you, Egad. Like, I get it, he's too old to do anything, but it's like... Also, there are no emergency stairs in this. Like, how did this pass code? Like, I worked in a retirement home, and we still had to have multiple things of, like, emergency, like, fire escape stairs. But, like, could any of them actually use them? No! I don't know. Okay, we found Poochie. Up. Wow. Okay, so we gotta figure out how to get in here. So I guess we're gonna... I guess we might be able to go in the long way, maybe? Oh, is Poochie gonna be a little shit? And be like... No, you have to go this way. I think he is. I think he is saying we have to go that way. Yo, how the fuck did we get in there? Hold on. Shut up, Egad. You are no help. Okay, hold on. Let's look at the map. Oh, hold on. Okay, so we need to get in here. I wonder if we need to just like look around. Whoa. Okay, like that's straight up not moving. Oh, yo, it might be this. Am I stupid? Yes, I'm stupid. It's fine. It's fine. I have zero brain cells. It's fine. Okay, Poochie is French. Confirmed. And... Oh, that... oh that's, that's just... That's just cash. Okay. Wow. Get like coins. Oh, that. God, why does this game expect me to aim? Okay, let's just go in here. We need to get another elevator key. Yeah, this pooch is definitely European. Because why not? Yeah. 
Let's like destroy everything so they can't tell us that we're not dressed appropriately. I was hoping for a hot cook to be like, hey, you're not supposed to be in here. Damn it. No, 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 no. Oh, great. Now we owe him what? Eight million yen? Lovely. We owe them eight million yen, or they're going to take that baguette and shove it where the sun don't shine. Lovely. Yeah, see, this is gonna be the biggest issue. Is just the sole fact of. Oh, it still does the same damage even when I beat them with like eight. There were like eight of them. I beat him to death with like eight of his buddies and it still did the same damage. That is some bullshit. I beat him with like eight of his buddies. I don't think I got any money out of that because I was just mad. Okay. Ooh. I, I I am always here for some arson. Okay. I I approve of this. Why why do we have to like prevent arson from happening? I approve. Sir, that is too big of a pan. You are not going to get a good sear out of that. Get over here, you son of a bitch. This is what you get for not being conscious. How hard is it to ask for a hot cup? Like you run out of fruit. What the hell just came out of that? There was some weird. Go oh, it was fish. Okay. I was like, there was some weird goop that came out of that. Why? Why did he have all them fish? Oh, I could have started killing him with fish. I'm sad. I could have Beat him with like a fish. That's like upsetting. 
There's nothing more fun. Wow. I, I want to set the place on fire. Why won't they let me commit arson? Oh, yeah. I forgot. This is like a big thing of like dealing with this bullshit. Oh, I forgot. There are several that use this mechanic. Take it to work. What the hell am I grabbing? It's fucking weird. I think this is what I do. Oh, you little motherfucker. Okay, now it's just like a stupid waiting game. Yeah. Oh, you little motherfucker. to stun it to death okay i didn't realize i'd have to st i i oh. thought i could just like suck it up no i like I it. stun it into Stop extinction out. oh motherfucker Get fucking hell ratatouille and i'm like 90 percent sure we don't do the same thing again But we have no cheese because of our fucking dog. Oh yeah, there's stuff over there, so... Hold on. Let's make it rain. Oh, we need that thing. Anytime anything is gold, it gives us money. I know that much. Luigi, get your bitch ass in there. Or am I supposed... Miss, you dumb bitch. Get in there, you dumb bitch. Did I seriously just do this for money? I have a feeling there's like cheese in here. Okay, I think I literally did this for money.
the thing. Oh yeah, I think it's like a regular bitch ass. Yeah. Come on, why can't... One more. I had no idea if this did anything. I was just like, let's just do it. Why not? I, I assumed it had something to do. What the? Hmm? Oh, I guess you could pull the balls out. I, I had no idea. Why, why do you want me to pull balls? Luigi! Here's my thing. I would not have an issue with this entire concept of having to chase these stupid rats around if it was before the big boss. Not after. That is the biggest thing that I have an issue with in this game is the fact that they're like, we're gonna make you do this after the fact. And it's like, you've already done everything. You've already, you know, we captured the boss in like the first 10 minutes probably. Now we have to go through all of this bullshit of catching these stupid ass mice for no fucking reason. It is a thing. It is a concept I hate so much. And I'm like 80% sure this is not the only time this happened. I could be wrong. I've been wrong before. That's nothing new. But I distinctly remember that this is not the only time this happens and we chase these stupid ass mice. Like, again, if it was, like, a key or something to get into the main boss room, that'd be fine. I don't want to have to do this shit after the fact. That is the thing that irritates me the most. It, it is after the fact. Okay, let's head up to four. I'm going to stop complaining about this. I have no idea if me drinking water picked up on camera or on mic. Luigi, you're doing a great job. Why don't you make your way back to the lab, okay? There's something I want to tell you. Do you see? Why can't you tell me now? You dumbass. I feel like this is just a way to break everything up, and I'm like, ugh. I don't care. Uh, again, I feel like. This is part of the reason why the first one is my favorite. Iga does not interrupt constantly. Oh, Luigi, you're finally back, eh? You shouldn't keep it all the way away, you know. Should've killed you myself, old man. 
have been busy down here. The lab is almost fully operational. Oh, yeah. By the way, Luigi, you must be getting pretty good at exploring a hotel, am I right? Have you been stocking up stock with the G... Huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Your pockets must be fit to burst it with all the money you picked up out there. Right not. I have the perfect solution for your cumbersome currency conundrum. Just give it all to me. Drum roll, please. I'm pleased proud to announce. Capitalism. The HSN is now open for business right here in the lab. We now have access to QVC. There's stocking some useful items. They're all for yours. Um, we're gonna buy the bone. I have to look here because I genuinely cannot read it on the uh, actual TV. Uh, basically, this just gives us something. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. I have one other matter to address while you're here. Luigi, could you turn it on for a moment? I need to adjust your Poltergeist G00. Take Luigi. I don't want him. And done. I just added a new fee. You wiggled it. My research indicates that booze are hiding in this hotel. I've added a feature to help you track them down. Don't worry about the details. I'll fill you in later. Well then, that's it for me, Luigi. Get back out there and keep exploring the hotel. Okay, we're gonna do QVC real quick. Cartridge that project the location. Okay. I'm not gonna worry about getting too much stuff. Because I think we should be okay. Hey, it looks like you've stumbled across a boo already. There's a sign that indicates a boo nearby. Let me explain in more details. Where there are no cars, uh, Guiji's body is made of material. I've dubbed goo. Goo re reacts to the frequency emitted by boo. So if there's a boo hiding nearby, the goo will vibrate to indicate it. I don't want vibrating goo. That's a friendly episode title. The closer you get to boost location, the stronger the vibration you'll be. You'll definitely be able to tell when you're really close. Uh, okay. Um, Guiji vibrates. I don't like that. I don't like a vibrating goo. Gem, first and foremost. That just went transparent. Is, is that seriously the only stairs we have? Okay, I am... Okay, I'm trying to find this boo. Wait, how do we- hold on. Did I miss something? Okay, it's like definitely in here. I cannot figure out how to get booze. 
Give me one second. Okay, so I have to press X on something. Oh, ho, ho, I'm Boozman. Boozman. Looks like you found me, or did you? So now we have to do that. Okay, I promise you, I'm not as terrible as catching these, but I feel like we did not get a proper explanation of how to catch these dump fucks. Oh, I didn't realize I had to like beat it to death. Oh, that's, that's actually really cool. You just blunt force trauma boo. Hear that there's kind of a bit. Blunt force trauma boo. I actually like that idea more than just like sucking him up. Because then it's like easier, like than the ghost. Because it's like 20. But like if you just have to blunt force a bitch. I don't know. That's that's just kind of fun. Okay. I'm actually going to end the episode a little bit earlier, um, but we do, we have vibrating goo, we can beat booze to death, it's going great. In the next episode, we'll make it up to 4-4 and see what the hell is going on. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see y'all next time. Bye.